of the structure. Let's cater for it. So currently we are looking for the third touch of that expanding chart. So in this video we will be looking at BTC USD, uh, ETH, Ethereum, and then Litecoin. So previously we were looking for selling opportunities on BTC USD. The reason being we have like this uh, expanding here and then yeah. push down, and then this was the larger flag that we had to push to the downside. And then let's move to the our chart and just show you uh, what we had on that analysis so what we had is this and then i was looking for an entry here as a tight flag as you can see just because i don't trade like btc usd but a few of my uh, group members are trading like this thing so this is the flag that we had and then you can refine it on the m15 and you can find a refinement on the m15 as you can see here and then we hit like almost the 90 percent rule so far and then the stop loss is around this area here so yeah this is what we had on btc usd so let's start over to the daily chart so let me just refresh everything so on the daily currently we hit like that double bottom area as you can see here so which means we are looking for buying opportunities so far up until like this area here so let me just uh move to the four hour just because we don't have like uh, too much of structure at the moment we have this descending channel around here this nice descending channel around here of which uh, price is trying to break like this descending channel to reach like the overall highs and then moving to the four hour let me just refresh everything so on the four hour that is where you see like the overall structure and all of that stuff so this is what we have around here some type of a descending channel within a descending channel or a running channel guys man. that's a running channel around this area we have a running channel like this so a running channel instead of looking for a selling opportunity you look for buying opportunities just because that's something of this nature let me just show you you'd have like a descending channel eh? in that descending channel you have a the last leg going to the upside in a form of an ascending channel so on this on that last leg you look for selling opportunities instead for instead of buying opportunities and then same in reverse if you have an ascending channel and then on that ascending channel at the last leg you have some type of a descending channel instead of looking for selling opportunities we look for buying opportunities same applies here so let me just remove that and then you have your highest high around here so we are looking for buying opportunities or buying pressure at the moment on the on the <coughs> btc usd currency cryptocurrency so we have like this double bottom currently and then I think uh, price will just evolve into a expanding pattern just because we have this uh, equal lows I think yeah I think they're equal and then we have this high here so what will happen I think the market will just reach this area come back to give us another low so that we can evolve the structure maybe slightly uh, slightly evolve the structure maybe to something of this nature and then as we remove like this uh, ray line around here then you'll have like an expanding pattern and then you look for buying opportunities around that area like that so that is how I'm looking at uh, BTC USD and then moving to each USD uh, so let me just remove everything if we have any analysis so move to the weekly chart then on the weekly chart uh, ETH has been going to the downside also but I can see we are trying to break structure at the moment now let me just draw that, that pattern clearly and then we have the highest high around here so let's move to the daily chart so that we can see everything so on the daily we have this nice uh, structure and then I think we haven't broken the structure we are currently at that structure that we should break 
and then we would have like a highest high around here just because the market can just trickle to that area and then reach here and then try to push back to the downside to complete like those uh double bottom area scenarios is because as you can see here the market has been going to the downside and then we haven't broken any structure people are not caught in the wrong side is because i'd be expecting the market to break this area before pushing to the upside so that did not happen as of yet so move to the uh four hour chart so on the four hour you can just draw out like the overall structures that you have and then we had this one as an ascending channel the 10 here so that we can understand everything so we have like this ascending channel you have this larger flag around here and then we have like a deeper correction trying to form up at the moment just because we haven't reached like this low here we hit the 90 percent rule around here so what i think the market will do it can reach like the same area here before pushing back to the downside so corrective move up until this area double top and then we look for sales either it is a risk entry at the top of the structure like this or you can wait for a more low risk entry type of entry around here six to eight hours then you take the cell around here stop loss is just above here and then you look for those lows as your overall take profit like that so moving to litecoin so let me just refresh everything so litecoin on the daily chat So we have been moving uh, to the downside for quite a while. So what I'll do now is that I'll focus like on the current market structure. And then as you can see, we had this push down and this is the corrective move. And then we have this low here. And then we have this as our higher high here as the market has cut people in the wrong side around that area. So which means we are looking for sales to complete like this low here. So yeah let's uh throw out everything that we need around there so we have the lows we have the high and then uh, we can draw out like whatever we have around here so we have this nice expanding around here like this and then now we focus on this current market structure and then let me just draw out a flag that we see here uh, let me just remove the relay and draw out the overall structure like this. So as you can see, we are looking for sales up until this area here. So let's move to the 4 hour chart. And then on the 4 hour, you can see that the market has been moving uh, very aggressively. So we have an ascending channel within there at the top of the structure. Let's cater for it. So currently we are looking for the third touch of that expanding channel and then we are looking for that overall tick profit that we have. So uh, what we have currently is that the market is giving us some type of a larger flag around this area with two bottoms and two tops and uh, you can look for sales on the break. Stop loss is just slightly above this area for seek profit on the third touch and then your second take profit is around here so that is it for our uh, crypto analysis so yeah i'll see you on another video